So we want to stay, by the way, on the currency theme with President Obama in China. Currency tensions are in focus. Some strategists say Beijing could be on the brink of letting its currency appreciate. Bob not convinced of that. Sarah Eisen, though, has been talking to some on the street to see if this is a turning point. Sarah. Hi, John. Well, it could be, and some currency strategists are betting that Beijing could make a move here in the next few months after holding its currency steady since July 2008. Morgan Stanley is among them. Some of the arguments for China letting its currency strengthen in the near term, one, China has been sending some strong signals, including changing its language on foreign exchange in the third quarter monetary policy report. People's Bank of China dropping the phrase, pledging to keep the renminbi, that's another name for its currency, stable. Analysts interpret this as a strong sign that policy could soon change. Number two, economic data continues to point to growth in the world's fastest growing economy. Normally in an export driven economy, that inherently makes a currency stronger. But China has been artificially keeping their currency weak and pegged. And this just puts more pressure to let its currency strengthen. Finally, the market is getting antsy. The way to look at this is 12 month non deliverable forwards. It shows the market expectations for the RMB currently pricing in a three and a half percent appreciation in the next year. Morgan Stanley says there's still opportunity there in those forwards as China will will gradually let its currency appreciate soon here. John. All right, Sarah with the latest on the currency story.